What's up everybody, Shija from Make Easier here and today I'll be quickly showing you how to create a QR code in Google Chrome. Now QR codes are becoming increasingly popular because of their ability to store data visually and their ability to, to display data quickly on smartphones. So if you're looking for an easy way to create QR codes instantly in your web browser, which is Google Chrome in this case, here's what you can do on your Windows or Mac laptop or desktop. So first of all, open Google Chrome on your Windows or Mac computer. Once that open, install the QR Creator app for Chrome. Now we've included the link in the description below, so be sure to check it out. I've simply pasted it into my browser. And the app will open in the Google Chrome store. It's QR Creator from zmind.com. It has a four star rating. And description, easy, create QR codes, instantly download and share easily, free. So that's all of install it, click on free, add, and the app will automatically appear on your apps page. Now remember this is an app, so it won't show up as an extension in the top right corner, but it will only appear in the apps page in your Google Chrome browser. So once it's installed, simply click on the icon to open it, and here you can enter some text or a URL that you want to link to. In this case, we'll be linking to www.maketechesia.com, and we forgot the dot in between. So once that's done, a QR code will automatically be generated. And that's it. Uh, now, if you want to add the code to your blog or website, you can simply download the image on your Windows or Mac computer. The image will save to your uh, computer. Here we're saving to the desktop and then you can upload it to your blog or website where your users or readers can scan it. Now, on the other hand, if you prefer to share a link on Facebook, Twitter, email, and a private message, instant message, etc., simply click on Get Permalink to get a shortened link. And this shortened link you can share with your friends who you want to share it. The link will lead directly to the QR code which can then be scanned. And it's as simple as that. You can scan the QR code to test it out just to be sure that it works. And that's it. Hope this worked for you. Be sure to like, share, and subscribe to our channel. We'll also be including a link to the written guide in the description below. So check that out. And thanks for watching. Shijar from Make Tech Easier. Have a good day.